traffic well i guess people are probably coming out of work it's friday 3 p.m right now um like i said we did go out around like 11 to marshall's earlier and then we went to the park and i just dropped my daughter off at home so my husband can put her down for her nap so i was like honey i'm gonna run really quick to the other marshall's so that's the plan um hopefully it's not too busy in there um and i can sh vlog a little bit but my mission is to go run straight and look for what i'm looking for so um sometimes i get distracted i don't feel like vlogging i just want to hunt what i'm looking for so i will talk to you guys in a little bit though i just wanted to say hey
you guys right now the lady's putting out stuff and I literally saw her grab these and I snatched them both from her and she went to the back to see if there's more because I told her what I was looking for she's so nice so wish me luck okay so she's back she didn't find anything but I'm so happy that I found those so that's fine Trying to see if I could find any cute blankets or any ghost pillows. This is cute. Wish it had some pink in it. Of course I can't leave without getting my baby something so I'm just looking at the books now. trying to hurry up and get across three lanes i just left uh marshall's and you guys saw i found the good witch bad witch mug set i'm so excited um but i'm also hunting for like any hello kitty um halloween mug i did find one earlier at the first um marshall's that i went to this morning but it was not the one that i was looking for i hadn't even seen that one it was like a ginormous mug and i was like it's cute it's hello kitty i'm gonna get it anyway but it wasn't um the exact one that i was looking for i am sweating you guys um but anyway so um i am i was texting my friend janine while i was in there and as i was texting her i was like no look on hello kitty she's like me neither i'm at marsha she's like i'm going to ross i was like i don't think they're at ross i think they're tj maxx and then i just happened to open instagram the literally the first picture i opened it to was someone posting hello kitty um halloween tumblers and saying that they found them at home goods so i was like oh my god janine it's home goods so there's a home goods right across the street so i was like i'm running in there um to go check um i am so tired though because like i said we went to a marshall's earlier this morning and then we went to go play with my daughter at the park and then i came and ran here and i just want to go home i'm hungry i've had nothing except my breakfast early this morning some bacon and eggs and i'm starving but i'm doing this we're gonna hunt these hopefully i don't get distracted by all this other cute shit and staying here too long i just want to look for these hello kitty mugs and run my butt out of here i told my husband that i wasn't even gonna be shopping i was like i'll be fast i'm just looking for some cups and then i found a lot more in this marshall's all right parking spot secured i'm right next to a basket check-in thingy too so if i have to drop my basket off also i gotta get, get gas on my way back home too because i'm my low fuel light is on so i'll see you guys in a second i'm gonna go inside how cute is this you guys breast cancer survivor cups they say fighter and then they have the ribbon on the back that's beautiful $14.99 they have a bunch of the Disney redone. They have Olaf.
they have Christmas out. What the? Wow. And I see pink. Oh my god, how cute is this? That's so adorable. Oh my gosh, look at how cute this gnome is. $7.99. Oh, cute. So they have one that has gray bottom and then this one is white. Those are so cute. Oh, look at him. He has like mixed colors and stripes. Too bad they don't have the gingerbread house yet that I've been hunting for years. It's literally my height, you guys. $250. Well, I guess fall is done and it's Christmas now. Got back in the car so no luck in home goods for hello kitty um i only spent 30 dollars. i was like wow i did good it was 40 and i had a 10 dollar reward um i don't even know what i got oh i did get that uh pink pumpkin that you guys probably saw um with the pearls on it because that was cute also you guys um, a lady gave me a pumpkin at the register for a dollar because I found this really cute pumpkin and it had a little stick in it like it came off of something like it looked like a little pick and there was this little those little white trucks that had like little stuff in it and they had those kind of pumpkins in it so I was like was this like staked down in there um, but I took it off I mean I didn't take it off it was already like just laying on the table so I grabbed it and I pulled the stick out and I took it to the register. I was like, there's no price on this. And she's like, um, she called for a price check and the manager was like, that fell off of a wreath. And I was like, oh no. And she was like, you can have it for a dollar. I was like, sure. So it was super cute. It's like one of the like little velvet pink pumpkins and I really wanted it. So um, I was happy about that for a dollar and um i did get something else that i'm so excited about but i'll wait and show you guys um when i do the haul because i have not seen this and i was like wow you're so cute though i was like i'm gonna take you home so i'm excited about it um and yeah that was pretty much it i think i, f I did grab a pack of those straws you guys saw me the little boo straws uh, so yeah so all right guys I am on my way to get some gas right now and then home I'm getting a little migraine because it is five o'clock in the evening and I ate breakfast at like 9 30 
they haven't had anything since i did get a coffee when we were on our way home from the park i stopped to get my daughter a happy meal and i got a iced latte from mcdonald's and all my milk all my milk all my milk melted all my ice melted already um it's still a little cool but the ice is out of it um but you guys know what it's like to drink um, kind of warm coffee on an empty stomach. I don't really feel like drinking that right now. So yeah, so I will see you guys in a little bit. Alright guys, so I am back. I have all of the stuff here in front of me. Uh, I went to two different Marshalls. I ended up going to Home Goods at the last minute that was not on the itinerary. But hey, it happened. Um, also... I'm going to show you guys that plus I'm going to show you guys I have an order from the at home store I have Walmart I have Ulta I have friend mail um I have QVC uh so it's going to be a huge haul not just my Marshalls and home goods and I'm actually going to start with some of the other stuff because I have if you can see like from my mirror in back of me this box is about my height I have boxes stacked and I can't get to the home goods and Marshalls bags because I threw them back there because this stuff was in my living room and I just brought it up. So we're going to open this stuff first. So grab yourself a coffee because it's going to be a long video. Um, my camera's already telling me I only have 44 minutes. Don't know why. So I might have to stop this, edit, and then delete. So yeah, so. Y'all know I talk more than 44 minutes. So let's start with the walmart box um this was just a they ship really fast i think i ordered this the day before yesterday either thursday night yeah i think it was thursday night um i literally have been going on every website that i can think of and just typing in halloween mugs to see what comes up and fall mugs those are my two top searches right now fall mugs and halloween mugs and um i found these on walmart.com and i was like oh you're cute i'm gonna get you so they are these super cute jack-o-lantern face mugs and you get four of them on the wire rack for $12.98. You cannot beat that. I was like, what? I love that this one says Happy Halloween. And look at it. They're all different faces. They're so cute. And I know I have a jack o' lantern um, mug that I got from Walgreens, which is totally different from this. So I'm not mad. And I also have the pink ones from Walmart. So I just really like the traditional orange color when it comes to like some of the holidays. So I thought these were adorable. They're freaking cute. Um, I might even just display this in my kitchen. And I'm just going to put it next to my coffee pot. My Keurig down in the kitchen. So I think it will be really, really cute down there. So yeah, so love that. Um, they also had the ghost ones. But they were sold out online. And I ain't got time to go to Walmart. So I probably won't be getting those. But if you guys are into, like, ghost mugs, I would say check your Walmart. Also, um, these might still be in stock online. Sorry, I'm going to try and kill two birds with one stone today and get rid of some of these garbage while I talk to you guys. Because I got too much stuff going on. Alright, so... I have a huge, huge box right here um, from the at-home store, and I really want to get rid of this one because it's taking up half of my room. And sorry if I shake you guys because I have you guys right in front on a little wobbly box. We got all of this stuff. I'm going to try and take that out and toss this over to the side. Oh my god. That was a lot. 
All right. I'm sure y'all already know what this is. I don't even know why I'm opening it. I know why I'm opening it. Because I want to freaking see it. I have waited 500,000 years for this baby. Oh my God, there's too much wrapping. Nobody has time. Give me my items. Give it to me. Oh my God, do you guys see how many layers I've pulled of this? Are they kidding? I feel like this is like one of those prank gifts that a box inside of a box inside of a box. Finally! Finally! Oh. oh my god, it's so pretty. Wow. Alright, so this is the gorgeous gingerbread house from at home store um it's obviously different from the one at home goods but look at all that glitter and the beautiful pastel colors in it oh my gosh and it lights up and um i don't know if you guys can see i just turned the lights on there it goes so this was 39.99 and this is the tag if you guys want to go online and try it's called Mrs. Claus Bakery Decor, I guess. I type in gingerbread house, and it was like the fourth or fifth option. Um, when I scroll down, this is gorgeous. Ah. So, I got that, and then they sent me three boxes for the stuff that I ordered. I also got this in a smaller box that I had already opened because it came by itself. So this is just a pretty pastel sign that says Noel. Beautiful. And you guys, I'm buried in here right now. Buried. Um, and then I got another smaller box from at home. So let's see. Was in these one? I am so hot. Y'all, when I tell you I be forgetting, I, I black out sometimes when I'm online ordering stuff. I be like, what? what I order? I ordered the Nutcracker. Oh, so cute. So he's totally the same, same colors. Has that same beautiful glitter, beautiful pastels. Doo -doo -doo. So cute. He has a little... um nick or something right there it just looks like his paint chip he got scuffed or something but it's the back so who cares but yeah this says it was 29.99 not 100 percent sure if that's what i paid but i guess so because i don't think anything was on sale that is stinking cute oh my god cute 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 all right this is a fire hazard in here, you guys. So, I have one more thing from at home store. So, after I placed this order, and I was like, I'm not driving over there. I'll pay the $10, whatever it is, for delivery. I spent enough. I was like, what's another $10? Tell me why after I did that, 
I saw something else I wanted and it was only like 20 bucks and I was like I'm not paying another ten dollars so I had to do a pickup order so I got the little one I don't know how that huge one is forty dollars and this tiny thing is twenty this should be like ten bucks but this is the small version of like the home goods uh one that came out so i did receive one of these last year from one of my friends on instagram marisol she was so sweet to send me one because i could not get this last year online was sold out and i had no idea that we had an at home at the time uh in chicago like here so i was like what um, when I finally realized that we had a net home this year, I was starting to look early for them. So, yeah. So, I was like, I'm going to get another one because she sent me one. And I kind of want like 20 of them. <laughs> Just joking. But I was like, I could, you know, put one on each side of something. Whatever I decide to decorate. If it's going to be my vanity or what. So, I wanted to. So, I got another one. So, my husband thankfully took me for the ride yesterday. And we went and picked that one up. That one also lights up, but the little battery isn't working, so. All right. Let's get into some of the stuff I got from the store. Um, the first thing, let's just get this bag out of the way because it's over there by its lonesome self. Um, this is Marshall's. I got this beautiful all-white pumpkin like bright white color not cream or anything it's bright white with white pearls all over and it even has a white glitter stem it is so beautiful this was only $14.99 and it's by that brand cupcakes and cashmere and I love that brand um but yeah this is so freaking cute it's a huge pumpkin too like it's bigger than my face and I just this is like stunning like i don't know where i'm gonna put it it does not match my decor in my living room downstairs in my house i have like traditional fall colors so i have like burgundies um golds oranges um and here in the beauty room i have like pink and gold so i'm probably gonna put it somewhere up here um but yeah i'm gonna get it out of the way for now Um, and let's just get started with, oh my God, this bag is heavy. So this is the second Marshalls that I went to. I actually threw some stuff in this bag because I was uh, sending pictures to one of my friends. So I know some of the stuff is from the first one, but this one is from the second one. This is just this pink sign that says boo and it has these beautiful Halloween gnomes on there. Um, and this was $7.99 and it has a little, uh, what is that? Like burlap? I don't know what that is. Like a little hangy tool thingy. So I'm probably going to hang this up over my coffee bar or something. I just like that it had the little thing there to hang it. So yeah, so it's by Quill to Paper brand. And I don't know if camera's picking up, but it is actually pink. And I wasn't sure if I've hauled this sign before because I know I found a bunch of signs um, before but I did pick this one up um, this is just a all white sign that says boo a all white outer sign and then the inside is pink says boo has a ghost this is the same brand and this was $6.99 I picked up a few signs I just I can't remember what they were so I was like if I have it I have it um, and then I saw this this is pretty it's a little um, it's like a little tabletop wooden block, I guess. Um, and it's just a pink pumpkin with gold glitter trim and it says Harvest Blessings. Yeah, I was like, I can't read. That does say Harvest Blessings. It's the same brand, Quilt of Paper. And this was $6.99. Sorry, my camera's not focusing. There you go. Um, and then I found this little Crim Shop Hello Kitty Macaroon Lip Balm. I've been collecting these lately. I keep finding them, so I'm like, yay. This one was $5.99. This one is one of the limited edition ones, and it's Sweet Sprinkles is the flavor. 
so cute i have another hello kitty one but it's red so i was happy to have one that has pink in it um and then i found this beautiful palette um it's by the brand beauty concepts and it says i put a spell on you and i know everyone was hunting the pumpkin spice and all of the like fall um pumpkin and palettes and stuff but i had hadn't seen this one so when i found it i was like oh i have to get that because i feel like this is gonna be perfect when i do do when i do do when i do a halloween theme drawer because i have a pumpkin spice theme like fall drawer so i am planning on switching it out strictly for halloween so i think this is gonna be perfect in there and i will show you guys what the inside looks like does come with a brush some eyeshadows and i guess that's i think they're just bigger eyeshadows because that's definitely not a blush color for me right there um so yeah so super cute uh beauty concepts is cruelty free by the way and vegan so that's interesting and this is only 6.99 i love how it's like uh what are these called cauldrons that's awesome and then the highlights of my trip you guys heard me when i inserted that clip there was a lady unpacking and she was so sweet i saw this i literally saw this so she had a brown box it was open like she had sliced it open and then went about her her way i guess she sliced a bunch of boxes open that she was going to start putting away and i don't know why my camera's getting dark you guys i'm sorry um I think my battery is draining. Sorry, I'm trying to look at stuff right here on my camera. I have a backup going, so ignore it. Let me see if I can adjust anything. That's probably too bright now, but hey, it's a little bit better than what it was, right? Anyway, so I saw like a cobweb and i was like the name of the brand that i'm looking for is cobwebs and cauldrons cauldrons and i was like oh my god i see a cobweb so i i like went like that and i was like oh my god i could see the pink and i was like lady where are you i went to hunt her down because she was putting away some tupperware i was like you have something that i've been searching for on that little cart of yours and she was like go ahead help yourself i was like really i can just go in there she's like yeah so say no more i went and there was two of them in there and I took them both. Um, I don't know what I'm going to do with them yet because I do like to have double mugs for certain things. So like I would like to have two pink ones and two black ones. But I also was thinking um, I might list one on my Poshmark um, and sew a set. I don't know yet but there was, a, there was two per box and... I told her because she followed me back and she was I was like can I have them both she's like you can have whatever you want you're paying for it I was like okay thank you so I did snatch them both and the lady was so sweet you guys I told her I was looking for so much more and she was nice enough to sit there and go through every box then she went to the back because she said she had two more carts of boxes she opened everything I was waiting for like 15 minutes she came back she's like try tomorrow she's like another truck is coming in but i don't have time to go back today but i was just like she i got a good associate i was so happy next i found this and i fell in love because autumn is literally like one of my favorite months it is my favorite season so when i saw this mug that said autumn babe and you guys know i've already said it before I'm very much into the traditional colors. I love burgundies and the golds and the oranges and the yellows. Um, I have a mug on my coffee bar already that says Harvest that is the same shade, also Ray Dunn. Um, it's shaped like a pumpkin. So when I saw this Autumn Babe, I literally died. Matches my hair also. Um, I'm planning on hanging this over my coffee bar because... My goal was to have all fall mugs, and I realized I have more Halloween mugs than fall, so I was on a hunt for fall-specific mugs. So when I saw this, I was like, yes, you are the one coming with me. So yeah, so I got that, and I screamed when I saw these. I ran up to them, and I was like, y'all, 
y'all. You're both coming home with me. <sighs> hello, Fall and Pumpkin Queen. Yes, yes, and yes. First of all, the Hello, Fall with all the colors in, in my, like, fall mentality is on this so yes i definitely needed that I'm gonna be using this right the frick away um i'm gonna wash this out and my coffee is going straight in there for work tomorrow currently i'm using a pink one that i got from duncan summer collection the one that came out that was like pink and orange they had an orange one they had a pink one i got the pink one i've been using that because i like love the way the cup the divot is where you drink from um but like i said spring summer is gone it's all about fall vibes so i need to start using this for my work coffee and i will probably be alternating it with the pumpkin queen i'm gonna wash them both out and have them ready to go i don't buy these for decor only i actually use the stainless steel ones because this is what i drink my coffee in so 14.99 they keep my coffee warm practically my entire 10 hour shift so I'm a very slow coffee drinker, so I fill it up and I sip on it throughout work. <laughs> Y'all, I don't know what's going on with the camera. I am so sorry. Um, like I said, I realized my backup wasn't on, so I turned it on this morning and it said I had 1,800 photos to back up. So I'm assuming that's why it's being dim because it's literally backing up as I'm talking to you guys. And I was like, um, okay, go ahead and do your backup. But yeah, sorry about that. So this pumpkin, I know I don't need more pumpkins, but this is for my living room. I kind of want it in here, even though it doesn't really match, but it could. I can have a pop of this beautiful orange. Guys, this is like the perfect, perfect color, like. She is so pretty, and she's that velvet material. Oh, my God. Do you guys see how beautiful she is? Beautiful. I don't know where the price is. Did it fall off, or did she make up a price? Don't know. Stunning. Stunning. Yeah, I, I loved this. When I saw it, I flipped out. <laughs> um, And then I found... Some more of these creme shop lip macaron things i didn't even know they had mini and mickey ones so i was excited that i found both of them mini and mickey mouse mini is strawberries and cream and mickey is watermelon taffy and then i found a cinema roll one and he's also limited edition so i have those two that are limited edition ones I found her at the second Marshalls, and I have found the other three at the first one. So I was like, woohoo. Like, when you find these, I feel like I'm like a little kid. I'm like, yeah, I found another one. And then I got some more of these hair clips. I hauled some of these, um, maybe my last haul from Marshalls. I can't remember, but uh, these are $7.99 for six. I remember specifically because I was talking about how kind of pricey, but I had one for like years um i don't really lose these things but i like the color pattern in this like the pink the gold i the other pack actually had the same exact one so i'll have two of those but the other pack had this plus a bunch of like more leopard um print ones so i felt like i needed like the pinky ish toned ones too so i got those and then I found this gorgeous palette, also by Beauty Concepts. It's called Peanut Butter and Jealous. I loved the packaging, and it's one of the harder case, outer cases. Isn't that so stinking cute? And then the colors were really gorgeous as well. So I was like, oh yeah. And of course it has a mirror. And then that is the colors in there actually looks like a really nice palette i will try it um it was only 6.99 so yeah i really like the packaging i was like oh you're cute i'm running out of space of stuff to put put stuff and then i found these pajama pants and i was like oh my god i haven't seen those like i have seen mostly all of them 
and I bought mostly all of them, but look at how cute these are by Ray Dunn. They have little cups all over them. Pumpkin Spice, Gobble, Cozy, Fall Y'all, Happy Fall Y'all, Blessed. These are so pretty. And I love the colors in them. And they're Ray Dunn. And they're so soft. And they have my favorite bottoms. They're just like the the um orange ones that have like the pie sizes and the ones that have been popular it's just these are like all mugs that say all the cutest things on there ever they remind me of all her little mugs so yeah um apparently this was supposed to be a two-pack because when i got to the register the lady's like was there a top and i was like no and i was like oh my gosh is there no price and she was like no she's like i'll give them to you for 9.99 because i think it was a set with $14.99 was the set. She said it was either another pair of pants or a top. Um, and then I actually saw them at another, at the second Marshalls. And they came with a gray pair of pants. I think it might have been in one of the clips. Um, but yeah, they came with a gray pair of pants. So um, so yeah, so she gave them to me for 10 bucks, So that was nice. I'm going to put those right there. All right. And then I got these cute paper cups. These are the first ones I bought for the year. I just really liked her leopard boots because I actually have a pair just like that. And I was like, oh my gosh, she's at a pumpkin patch holding her coffee, wearing all the fall vibes. I was like, I need that. And this is what the little sleeve looks like. It's just polka dots. These were $4.99 for 12 cups with the lids and the sleeves. Super cute. Her cup, I don't know if you guys can see it. It says PSL. So cute. All right. I found two mugs. I was on the hunt for every Hello Kitty Halloween mug there is out there. I struck out, but I did find one. And the one I found was not one that I had even seen. I literally was hunting a pink one that has like a spider web. There's a purple one and there's a teal one. And then I saw this and I was like, listen, I want Hello Kitty and I want Halloween. So it is what it is. But this one is ginormous. It's 25 ounces. And it actually looks just like the same style as my pumpkin spice and everything nice one so this is the one that i have on my coffee bar right now because like i said i'm all about the fall vibes right now not halloween so this one is the one i have now and the inside is a deeper color and then this one's like a brighter orange but it's the same exact style mug the same size so um I don't know. There's no price on this one, but this one was $6.99, the Halloween one. So I'm assuming it was the same price. But yeah, uh, very, very excited that I found at least one. So she's going to go away until I put out my Halloween decor. And then the last mug I found, y'all, I saw this and I ran to it. Didn't pay attention to anything. I was like, oh my God, it's pink and black. It's one of the pink and black mugs that I'm looking for um, by Cobwebs. I'm literally hunting everything. And then when I was showing pictures to my friend, I didn't even pay attention. I literally grabbed it and put it in a car and kept, kept it rolling. I didn't realize it said $4 as is. And I was like, as is, what's wrong with it? Guys, there's like something on the inside right here. You see this? But I think I could still use it to drink. It's just like a little chip. But it doesn't have like... It's not like all the way down. So I don't know. Maybe I can use it. If not, I'm just going to put it on my coffee bar as the cup of display, you know. But yeah, I was excited. It is dishwasher and microwave safe. But just has a little crack. But I don't see... It doesn't look like a deep one. Like, if you guys know what I mean. But yeah, I was happy to find it. Four dollars, I'll take it. Uh, gosh, there's another thing over there still. Alright. Oh my gosh, I finally found this, you guys. I finally found this Hocus Pocus palette. It's by Beauty Concepts. And this was $3.99. It's a bronzer, blush, and highlight palette. 
I have been seeing this everywhere and like all over Instagram. All my friends have been finding it. And I was like, I want that palette. So I am so excited to put that on display um, in my Halloween drawer when I put up this. I think they're going to go so cute together. And also what's going to look cute with them are these freaking lip balms that I found by Body Prescriptions. And they have candy corn, spider webs, cats, pumpkins. These are totally Halloween vibes. So I'm excited to put this out. Um, these were $4.99. <clears throat> so I got my little Halloween stuff coming. And then I found a bunch of the Creme Shop face masks by Hello Kitty. I get so excited when I find these. So these are called the Brilliant C Boost. And they have vitamin C and retinol in them. And you get three for $5. They come in this little bag. I found a couple of these the last haul that I did. And then I found these fall ones. I'm so excited. So these are Hello Pump Plumpkin. And they're limited edition. They have pumpkin enzymes, collagen, and allotonin and how adorable how freaking adorable is this packaging so yes these were $4.99 and there's three of them in here as well and then I found these pumpkin spice latte they have pumpkin seed oil squalene and lactic acid and those are so cute these aren't Hello Kitty but they're from shop $4.99 for these also for three so these are adorable like, when I see that stuff, I'm like, shh, shh, snatch it up real fast. And I'm, like, looking around, like, if is, is anyone looking at how crazy I am? Then I found this Creme Shop Mini Mouse Scrub. My friend Janine um, went shopping, and she was sending me pictures of what she found, and she sent this. And I was like, oh, my God, that's so cute. I want that. And I didn't realize that the, the scent is Sweet Clementine. I didn't even open this and see that it was like this. I literally saw it and threw it in the cart. Um, but it looks like it's kind of open, but I don't care. Probably not even going to use the stuff. I just want to... Look at how, the, how cute the top is. But anyway, I didn't know that it was Sweet Clementine. I saw the color in mini, and I thought it was pumpkin for some reason, but I don't care. I like Clementine scent. Um, but yeah, it's a sugar body scrub for smooth and nourished skin. And it's supposed to be $5.99, but mine was marked down to $4.50. Um, I hate, I was telling her that I found it, but I hate that they put the sticker right here because it's right on the front label. And then I have to try and peel that and make it all perfect. hate it when they do that. Like, why can't they use the bottom? I swear. So I got that. And then, what else is in here? Oh, I found this spray. I really wanted this spray. I buy a spray almost every time now when I go. They did the same thing. They put a label right here and it's driving me nuts. Um, this one is called Sexy Secret and it's total BS vibes, right? And I just love that. And this was $6.99 and it smelled really good. I sprayed it in the store. I always see this and I always pass it up. But one of the girls I follow on Instagram, I don't know how to pronounce her username. D-U-N-I-S. I think it's Duna Shayla or something like that. Um, but she's such a sweetheart and she always posts this bottle and it, it just looks so pretty and aesthetic in her photos. So I was like, let me see how that smells. And I was like, you know what? Who cares? Because I'm going to buy it anyway. So yeah, so I did buy it anyway. And then the last thing I found, I was so excited to find this. Um, I do have a friend, um, one of my really close friends on Instagram, Claudia. She's sent me a package before I've sent her stuff. Um, she found the fall lip balms I was looking for. She found the pumpkin spice, um, like the little, the little mini palette, I think it is. I don't know if it's a highlighter or a blush. I don't even know. It just has a pumpkin pie on there. I just saw it and I was like, I need that. She found that for me, and she also found me the lip balms that say Hey Boo on there. So I was so excited, and she found me the pumpkin spice ones, which I ended up finding yesterday. So I'm also going to probably post this on my Poshmark. 
Um, so my Poshmark will be linked down below. I don't know if it'll be on there by the time I post this because I'm still deciding. Um, there's, I have a couple of options. Um, I do want to have a giveaway for you guys soon and I'm trying to see what I'm going to put in it. But it also, I'm trying to put some of the popular things on my Poshmark right now because I'm almost at ambassador level on my Poshmark. So I'm trying to get my Poshmark to be an ambassador so i do need to have a few more listings so i think i'm gonna put this on here but anyway these mostly everyone has them by now anyway they're sweeter than pumpkin pie moisturizing lip balms they have cinnamon toasted almond pumpkin spice and apple pie and they were 4.99 um yeah so she actually found this for me i had given up i was like i'm never gonna find them and then i find them and she actually sent me the tracking yesterday but I'm excited because she has those other two items that I have not found. So, um, I have now the home goods stuff. And we are running out of time. I keep looking at the screen because we're at 35 and my camera says I have 44 minutes. So, home goods i found this you guys saw it in the clip saw me put it in the cart this is like a, it's a pink but it's like a more uh rosy colored pink and it has pearls everywhere they were very messy with the glue um which i didn't even pay attention to at the store i'm looking at it now like look at all the glue um around the stem but yeah this is really really pretty i love um these like velvety ones that are like like that plush um this one was $12.99 I think I also showed you guys in the store clip but yeah love that one I was excited I found two pumpkins with pearls on there I love pearls then you guys this pumpkin I did a I did a bad thing you guys so this was laying on the table where that one was with the pearls and I was like this is so freaking cute. I was like, I need that. Um, it's just like a very velvety pumpkin too. But look what they gave it to me for a dollar. If you look in the bottom, oops, I just ripped the dollar off. There was a stick in here. So I could tell it stuck down in something. So I took the stick out, threw it away. And I went to the restaurant. I was like, I don't know how much this is. It was the only one. And she's like, that fell out of a wreath. And I was like, oh no. I was like, where's the wreath at or what? And she was like, I can sell it to you if you want for a dollar. I was like, mm, sure, I'll take it. <laughs> Duh. So, yeah, so I thought this was so cute. I love that it had a gold stem. So, yeah, so, so excited that she uh, gave it to me. I, at first, I was like, if she tells me she cannot sell it to me, she's going to find that wreath. So, um, I found these at the checkout. These are just some straws for $4.99. I don't know what I'm going to use them for, but they were cute. They're pink, and they have, like, little ghosts. Um, I, obviously, I know what I'm going to use them for. I'm going to put them by the coffee bar. Um, and then I found these cups. These were super cute um, for my Halloween. I have my fall ones, and now these are my Halloween ones. These are pink. And they have just spiders and bats and spider webs. And then it has this little cute ghost sleeve. These are by Clementine brand. And you get 12 for $4.99. With the lids and all that jazz. Oh, what is that? And why is it heavy? I did grab this candle that I showed also by that Clementine Paper Ink Company. It's in Pumpkin Latte. I love the pink with the gold lid. I love that the lid had something on here that says 100% that witch. And it's Pumpkin Latte scent. I can't believe this was $12.99 and I bought this for $12.99. This looks like it should be like $7.99. I didn't even realize. Sometimes I tell you guys, I blank out. I'm just like, add it to the cart. But now that I'm thinking about it, $12.99 is a lot for that little candle. And the last item. And I think it might be my favorite. Oh, you're so cute. Are you guys ready? 
Look at this little guy. It's a gnome with a freaking pumpkin head. Look, though. It's a candle. Oh, my God. And it's by Martha Stewart. I have not seen this. And it smells amazing, you guys. It's like the white pumpkin scent. Like the all the big pumpkin candles. And her moth, the other pink pumpkin ones that Martha Stewart makes. But this is a two wick. Smells amazing. It literally was the only one. And I was like, it's pink. As soon as I saw the pink, I was like, what is that? And I was like, oh my gosh, it's a candle. I had to get this for $12.99. See, that's what I mean. This guy was $12.99 and that little thing was $12.99. That makes no sense. Like, this is a whole reusable candle jar with a topper. I don't know how they price some things sometimes. All right, guys. I am going to end this for a second. I'm going to clean up. I'm going to try and upload some stuff. And then I might come back and open up the Ulta and Friend Mail and QVC boxes with you guys in a second right so i'll see you guys in a minute all right y'all so i'm back uh let's open up my box from ulta i didn't clean anything i was like i'll be right back i'm gonna clean a little and figure out my storage thing but um I literally pressed one button on my phone and it said I had memory. I just needed to empty my, my trash on my settings. All the videos that I filmed on my phone, I hit delete so they're not in my camera roll, but they weren't trash trashed. So I just had to empty my recycle thing and it said I had some storage. So here is my little order. I just threw everything out of the box. Um, I was running low on toner. I told you guys I love my skincare. I love toner. And I ordered a new one from Good Molecules. But um, I wanted to restock. I've used this in the past. Thiers. Thiers. This is the rose petal one. And I just wanted like a really basic simple one. That was more. So this is alcohol free. More like a witch hazel kind of toner like for cleaning my face so i got that and i wanted a brown mascara most of my mascaras are black and i wanted a brown one i just always feel like brown compliments my eyes makes them pop a little bit better um and apparently this covergirl one it's called lash blast volume was like one of the top rated on ulta's website so i just got it in the black brown i wish it was just brown i hate when they're like black brown because they still kind of come off as black to me but yeah it says it's 10 times volume i've never used this one so i was like i'm gonna try it and then what i really was on there for were for these hello kitty glamnetic nails never tried the glamnetic but i know um charla and Lindsay have used them before and I feel like they both kind of said that they're really good and that they last longer. And I'm a press-on girl. And I get mine to last about two weeks, but I really have to keep reapplying them. So I'm wondering if these are going to be any better. I also bought the Glamnetic brush-on glue that they have. Um, so I don't know if it'll make any difference, but that's the packaging. So it's like a little brush on glue. So yeah, these are so cute though. Hello Kitty collaboration with them. And they're like my length because when I'm at work, I don't want to wear them too long. So that looked like a nice length. And this is actually was already in my cart. I had been waiting to get this. This was only $18 and I had a $10 credit. So I was like, next time I place my order, definitely getting this. This is a little mini ariana grande little mini body spray set and it has thank you next um cloud ari and sweet like candy is that yeah sweet like candy so i am obsessed with all of her perfumes and i love layering the body spray with the perfume because it lasts longer and i also have the roller ball so i had to get that um so that's what I picked up from Ulta, and I literally just put all of that on top of the next box I need to open. I so smart. 
All right. I think this is QVC. I don't know why it's so heavy because I don't remember ordering anything except one thing. But again, I black out so. What the? I've never seen this kind of a box filler before. What are these? Okay, I'm about to stab myself in the face. You guys see that? What is this? Guys, I gotta put that down. I'm about to make another mess on my floor. Oh, I remember now. I remember. You guys, I am. I remember. Sue. So, I ordered these mugs. Because, like I said, I was looking for fall mugs. And I was on there looking for something. And I found all four of these for a very affordable price. And I have a mug by this brand. And I love the shape of it. These are by the brand 10 Strawberry Street. And they say Pumpkin Spice Queen on them. Aren't those cute? Oh my gosh. I needed this to go on my coffee bar. Because like I said, I needed fall mugs. And these are gorgeous. I have one that says Happily Ever After by this brand. And I really like it. They're dishwasher safe and microwave safe. I was trying to see... How many ounces um because it's not huge but it's also not small it's like a nice size mug so um when i said i ordered these mugs it was because it is a four pack so i have four of them and i was thinking of selling two on my poshmark and then keeping two so that is is that everything that's in there i totally ordered other stuff I don't know if my other stuff is in here. Maybe they're shipping it separate. There's so much of that stuff in here. It's hard to tell. But I hope it's not in here. Anyway, I'll tell you guys what I ordered. Wait, did I get it? Or oh, no, I didn't get it already. I'm confusing the Too Faced Better Than Chocolate with the Pumpkin Spice Second Slice. I ordered the, the Second Slice Pumpkin Pie Palette. That's what I thought that was in there, but... It's not. Next, I have friend mail from my friend Martha. Uh, she sent me something that I was hunting again because she found it again. And she's the best. She's so sweet. And I don't know. A bunch of you guys are just like absolutely like the nicest people ever i'm so happy that i found so many of you guys through youtube and instagram because it's like i have like real life friends on the internet oh my gosh she sent me goodies too um yeah so let me show you guys first what i was hunting and what she found for me so if you guys watched my burlington video a while back a couple of videos not that long ago i was like i found every color except for the freaking pink one i wanted this pink sparkling pumpkin so bad and they literally had like navy they had white they had green they had cream and i was like where's the pink one and she saw my video. She's like, girl, my Burlington, I guess it was Burlington. She's like, they have, um, she's like, I'll go back for you. And yeah, it was Burlington. I can tell from this, uh, tag. Uh, so these are $10.99 at Burlington. She's like, I'll go back for you. And the fact that she keeps saying that, like, I'll go back for you. It just means so much to me. Cause it's like, she go, she's like going out of her way for me. Um, it has little pearls on top. I don't know if you guys can see it. It's like sequins with pearls and it even has like some little studs like it's just like a multi 
texture kind of pumpkin and it's so different from anything I have that's why I needed it be be excluding the fact that it's obviously pink but like and it looks like it's about the same exact color as this one so I think these are gonna look so cute next to each other they're the same color they both have some pearls on them and then this one's just sparkly oh my gosh I just want to I want my whole room to be pumpkins everywhere I'm gonna build my own pumpkin patch better than before and this looks so nice with the pillow too is that upside down yes definitely upside down like it looks so pretty with my pillow my pillows from last year if you guys are new and haven't seen that that was from home goods and i think they might have them again this year so oh what are these are these stickers these are stickers i think i could put these on my planner so she sent this too how cute are those wait are they stickers or are they like i don't think they're clings those are cute i'm already like oh i could stick this on something yeah I guess the thing that said stickers was covered up. It literally says stickers. These are cute. You know what? I use stuff like this. So I have Ray Dunn canisters on my kitchen. And I don't like paying every time she'll like throw a clover on one. And it'll still say tools for like all your big utensils. So I'll be like, I'll throw a leprechaun sticker on mine. So I feel like these are something that I would decorate my canisters with downstairs to make them like fall. These are so cute. They're like a 3D sticker. Can you guys see that? I've never seen stickers like this, but they're totally like a 3D sticker. These are cool. Oh my gosh, I want to put them on something right now. Thank you, Martha. I love these. Have not seen. I just like the colors, pink and orange, and they have like little ghosts. I'm going to put that ghost on something, and I'm going to make my own little ghost mug. I'm so goofy. And then, I'm like trying to ignore the fact that this is in there because y'all know I'm on keto. Pumpkin Spice Milano cookies. I saw these and I think I posted them in my stories. Um, I posted everything pumpkin that Target had. It was like my way of just like kind of indulging but not indulging because I can't really eat it. Um, so, I've been on keto for almost two months now with no cheat days i'm very strict i um i'm lying i had a pumpkin donut like two weeks ago but i am very strict no sugary coffees uh no carbs none of that um and i was like 162 and i'm 148 right now so um i'm i'm almost at my goal um i think by october i'm gonna be done so i'm gonna hide these away until october I cannot wait to taste these. I love Milano cookies. I like the like chocolate ones. Um, so I, my mouth's watering right now thinking about how these must taste. Uh, but yeah, for all of you pumpkin spice lovers, uh, Milano has pumpkin spice cookies. So I'm going to hide these though because I also, I also have some candy to hide. Um, I have my favorite Pika Pika candy, and it's not open. These are the Sour Patch Kids with the, like, Pika Pika stuff on them. Um, my, one of my friends from work, uh, she's uh, one of my bosses before. Um, she had a birthday, and I placed an order for her, and I ordered some for me. But I'm not eating mine, so I'm going to put mine to the side. There's one last thing in here, and it's, like, wrapped up, so I'm going to open that. <clears throat> But yeah, thank you so much for the, the treats. I have, I also hid some more candy and I don't know where I hid it, but I did tell my work bestie and he was like, I remember I wrote it down. So I was like, okay, don't tell me right now. I was like, tell me in October when I ask you. Oh my God. Are you kidding me? Martha, stop. These are so. You guys, look at these. These are Betsy Johnson freaking pumpkin spice earrings. Are you for real? It's funny because she doesn't even know I'm hunting all of the Halloween earrings that I can find. And like, let me just show you guys. Oh my gosh, these are so freaking perfect. So I ordered, you guys saw I got these little trays from AliExpress. 
Um, and I've been like putting my little Halloween and like earrings in here. So I have a couple from Babel Bar um, in here right now. And oh my gosh, how freaking cute are these going to look at it? She doesn't even know that I'm collecting these. It's like, see, we're so in tune. Look at that. Oh my gosh. Thank you so much. I cannot wait to put these in here and put them in this drawer. So yeah, so I was like trying to fill this up and I was, I put it in my middle drawer so that when the drawer is closed, I can look down at them. They're so cute and festive looking. So, oh my gosh, I have not even seen these. I know Betsy Johnson always has cute stuff, but these particular ones, they're so cute. And they're actually two-sided, so they say pumpkin spice on them, but when you turn them around, they say sweater weather. Oh my gosh, these are adorable. They're like little clip-ons. I don't know where she found them, but they say $12.99. They would normally be $18. So I don't know if she found these at Burlington, too. I can't really tell by this tag, like, what, what store that was from, but wow, thank you so much, girl. You're the best. I swear you're the best. So, the last thing I have over here, I posted it on my Instagram. Um, I got this cup. It's a pretty tumbler from SSX Customs. Um, I'll, I'll link her shop below. Her name is Sheena. She's one of my friends on Instagram. And she came out with these. It says, it's coffee time. And it's from the movie Scream. And what I really liked about it was it says, no, you hang up first. There's a few of them that says, boo, you whore. And I didn't want my cup to say that because I have a two-year-old and I just don't want a cup that says anything like that. Or um, I don't know if it's boo, you whore. Isn't that mean, girls? I don't know. I know it, it has profanity on the cup and I didn't want that on my cup. So I just like that this one just says, you hang up first. Um... And I like, it's one of the like little snow globe cups. So it has like all of that falling down. These are so cute and her lid is completely blinged down. It says boo on there and it has her shop logo on the bottom. But I will link it for you guys and it's, she can do it with a black lid if you guys are more into black or the pink one of course i got the pink one but yeah this is so freaking cute and so much time not only does she have to do the like snow globe stuff but like printing out all of these and like sticking them and then all of the like bling like it's so much time to make these so yeah i'm very very uh appreciative that she sent me one uh i was gonna buy it regardless i was already as soon as i seen it it was like on my feed on my instagram and i clicked on her shop first i commented i was like omg need and then i went to click on it on her shop and i was like where is it where is it and she was already messaging me asking me what color lid i wanted so thank you so much sheena i really really appreciate it um but i will link it for you guys below you guys need one um especially if you guys have been seeing those because I, I feel like all of the shops are making like Scream this year. But like I said, I really liked hers because of what her said. Um, yeah, I'm looking around to make sure I ain't got nothing else because my room's a mess right now. Oh, if you guys could see my room. It is so bad. I am going to stop right now so that I can get this video. It's going to be so long. I'm going to get this together. And I actually have another video to film for you guys. So... I think this one's going to go up first and then the other videos, hopefully for Pink Wednesday. I'm sorry I didn't have a Pink Wednesday video last week, but at least you guys got a really long one last weekend. So, um, it's just hard filming really long videos and then doing another one, um, right after because obviously I have a daughter and a family. So, um, but yeah, I'm going to end this so I can hurry up and quickly clean because the other one's going to be short. Um, so I will see you guys on the next video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Leave me a comment. Let me know what your favorite thing from this haul was. And I love you guys so much. Thank you so, 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 so much, Martha, for the package. Thank you, Claudia, for the package that has not arrived. And I will see all of you guys on my next video. Don't forget to give me a thumbs up. 
and if you haven't already subscribed and if you're new here i'm so sorry that i ramble a lot and i didn't introduce myself but hi i'm evita and you see the kind of videos i film so if you got if you like that then just subscribe so you don't miss any of these because i do them very often all right love you guys for the hundredth time bye